So, well actually the first thing is to look at the app. So if you press the apps button, if there's a lot of apps there, that means that basically they've all got to be cleared. If the apps aren't there, it's only the ones you're supposed to do. You can just do a simple delete of the, the RAM without the, deleting the apps as well. Can you show me how it's okay. done? Yeah, okay. without actually doing it, if you don't mind. All right. yeah. So, in on mine, yeah. if you look at mine, these are the apps that you're meant to have, which is the finance one is there all the time. You can never get rid of it. Easy data, you're not going to use for maths. It's only for um, science, but you're allowed to have it, so I always put it back. But the important one is the poly one that they use for simultaneous equations and things. And so if it's got those three, or at least just the poly one and the finance one, then you don't have to delete apps. So you just go blue one and then the plus sign, the mem, like that. And um, go down to number seven to delete. And if you delete all RAM, <coughs> number one, and you just pick number two for reset, do that. It's now cleared all the RAM, but you'll notice the apps are still there. And so if you don't need to delete apps, then you can just do that. So you just, it's always that one, blue one, the plus, and then seven. And if you're not deleting apps, it's just the RAM that you want to delete. And you pick all RAM, and that will delete everything that's in there that's not apps. And that, just go to that, reset. That yeah. tends to solve a lot of student problems when they have issues with calculators. Right, and that's something they need to know on what to do on the yeah. day of the exam. Yeah. Yeah, but that's. But the only thing is, after that's done, immediately, it, it will put it into radians. So you need to go and put it back into degrees. And then you also need to go down to stat diagnostics and turn that on instead of off. Otherwise, regression won't work, which for studies is very important. Oh, so where was that? Was that stat in the same menu? Stat as... diagnostics. But where was this menu? Sorry, I didn't see where. That is uh, just in mode. So you just press mode. And, and it's down below. Oh, I didn't even. I've never even seen the, the next screen on that. That's one. right. Okay. So yeah. So that's the thing to check. That it's in degrees. I know kids are supposed to check that themselves, but it's best to, to make sure. And then the other one, the important one, is the stat diagnostics, which must be on. I don't know why they've made it so it goes off. That's a bit silly. Now, if it, so that's if you don't have to delete any apps. If you have to delete any apps, um, it takes ages to delete them one at a time. It's best to delete them all and then just put back what you need. And that really is annoying if that has to happen on the day of the exam, so it's much better if kids already have the correct apps. Then all you need to do on the day of the exam is that simple little clear of the RAM, and that's it, you're done. Okay, so let's go to that one. It's St. L's calculator. You can see here, you press apps, there's all the, in fact, um, unfortunately there's no way to prevent certain apps being deleted, you've sort of got to do the lot. So the way you, the same thing, you go there, memory, and seven. But this time we go to all instead of just... Yeah, um, don't, don't do that, yeah. Right? So don't do that because you're gonna clear everything, is it? Well, all my apps will go away? Yeah, you yeah, yeah, I don't want that, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. Right. So, so is that what I have to do to but make then sure? after you've done that... Right, so I'll, just press all. I'll do yeah. it on mine. Okay, yeah, I'll do then it maybe I can, we can transfer. Okay, yeah. so... Thank you. All right, so... Okay, so here is my one, and if I go to apps, here you can see that now. If I go clear, and the mem one, and I go to seven, and if I do all, and I go down to reset, it'll say resetting all. When that's done, <coughs> there won't be any apps either, that will be gone. So if I look at apps now. Finance is permanently there, but all the other apps are gone. So to put, say I want to put back, um, I've never done it this way, so we'll see if it works. Remember you mentioned the other time you can use the receive, send. That's what I'll do now. Yeah. What, not, what did you do here? I'm not okay. sure if it works with that okay. plug. Wait, every student's going to have to plug in, I guess? 
No. This is a this USB or? No, this is a that's oh. the data cable okay. that normally goes to the USB. I think okay. it's just a serial cable. I okay. think it's faster than oh. or a parallel one is faster than the okay. serial one or something. I don't know. Okay. Alright. Yeah. So first of all Can you bring the calculus okay. together? Yeah. yeah. So we're gonna transfer apps from here to here. Okay. Right on. So I normally do it from my computer, I don't know this way. So we use the link thing, so you go there and link. There it is. So, and we're going to send. If you're going to receive, you put it on that one. So this one here we'll put on receive. So we'll go there and link. This one will be receiving. This one will be sending. So I can put that into receive mode now and it's waiting. This one, go down to, we want to send apps. So we're going to go down to apps there. And what I want to send is the easy data one. So I just press enter and it selects it. And I also want to send um, polysmelt, so I press enter for that. So it should now send both of those. And when I've selected the ones I want to send, I go to transmit and I just select that. And now it's sending them. So it's going into the other computer, other TI. And just wait a moment. Shouldn't take long. I didn't see for the receive. Did you when you went to the receive tab on top? Then mm -hmm. there was a you had to press one for receive when you to go to the waiting mode. That's right. I missed that mm -hmm. part too. Mm -hmm. Okay. So again, with the students, what are yeah, they going to do? Yeah, it's done. Now, if I, now on my calculator, if I press apps, you can see I've got the apps there. Now. So it's transferred them. Okay. So, so if, if students have multiple hundreds of apps on their calculator, clear them all and then just put on those ones. Okay. Can I stop? Yes. Okay.